Good morning and welcome to the beaches of Hossegor, France. We now shift our focus to the men's side of activities. The Quicksilver Pro France now enters round three of competition. Of course, 36 surfers get chopped down via round two and now another elimination round. So big heats unfolding as you join us with the high-flying Keanu as Singh falls out the sky and gets a quick opener here in the round three heat one encounter. Taking on Ace Bucken, Keanu is seeing strong and now, well, strong rail work for Ace to get going. So same rip bowl that we've just seen Steph Gilmore and the girls wrap up round three on will be our arena here as we move into men's competition. Still through to Peniche in Portugal late next week, the back part of October and then through to the Banzai Pipeline. But much to talk about here and it's all eyes on the European leg. As Keanu is seeing, you spoke about the rip bowl and how you're liking it, Ross, but it's a second quick wave unfolding here for young Keanu. Uh, Hawaiian in blue. Nice little squared up turn. So quick repetition here. Two waves offered to the judging panel early on in this opening round of competition for the men this morning. You know, he seems to always be doing what he wants on the wave, but right there, a pretty gutsy start there. Nice float. Keeping that board working through that fat section right there. Uh, so Keanu's going to be deadly. I also like the fact that, uh, you know, he's on his backhand. Uh, so he's going to be able to get right up in the pocket vertically. This is the second wave. A better wave, even though it's smaller, it stayed steep throughout that section on the inside. Good tempo right there for Keanu, staying patient. This is where that wave kind of got funky, though. Of course, matching up against Ace Bucken. Ace such a precise surfer and this is that rip bowl that you're talking about Ross he keeps finding the little inside check that'll be a throwaway but now the 783 top left of screen is made up of two scores now for Keanu a 4 and a 3.5 are the numbers oh this is what makes uh, Adrian Bucken so tough to beat you can see how uh, studious he is he's sitting on the outside he's being very selective uh, so I think for Ace Bucken he doesn't make many mistakes. He usually capitalizes uh, very well on the way, but he's looking for that specific wall. He wants that steep, long wall. Well, here we go. It'll stand up ahead, and Ace will go into the top corner. So nice line over the lip there. Open face hack from Ace. Beautiful precision on the wrap. Such a methodically clean surfer. Often hear the word surgical as we describe Ace. And now we'll pick up on Keanu as Singh. So repetitive action here, high content as we get into the Quicksilver Pro France for a Saturday morning. Well, this first snap right there, easily the best turn we've seen so far in this heat. So great way to kind of grab the judge's attention from Keanu. This was the second wave of the heat, or of the, of the set. And uh, we talked about how Ace Bucken wants to be very selective. and he, you know, He's got great wave knowledge. He waited for this one right here. Also a great opening turn, a little bit of a floater. I'd say so far Keanu got the edge on that first turn. But this wave had a little more wall to work with and uh, a very sharp angle on that cutback. I love the little rebound matchups because, uh, hey, if I lose, no worries. I got another chance. But this one, uh, you just feel that energy in the water. In the water. You know, they really have to get it done. Ace Bucken activating here, wave number three. Trying to select an inside opportunity. You see it's run through a little bit of a bump. And Ace will uh, eject on that. He'll know that that is a throwaway. Ross, you're talking about round three. It's as much of a slap in the face, in the, a loss here in round three as it is in round two. Except it's worth just a little bit more points than a higher finishing uh, place. Especially for um, someone like Keanu Singh, who really need, needs to go deep in this event to make the top uh, 22. So Ace running through the inside section here. Choosing the uh, repetition in the bowl here, Ross, and we'll see how he finds an opportunity to conclude. He doesn't. So a little bit of a slopey shoulder at the end, but clean rail work. The crowd appreciative. Lots of people flocking down to the beach here in Hossegor. We are on the northern beaches. This here, the Plage Le Quilneu, just north of the river and estuary inlet at Hossegor. And the crowds are packing in. We saw tons of people shipping into town last night. 
There's a big weekend unfolding here in France as we see Keanu Asing now. Nice snap, second one of this delivery. That's a big square corner and he'll hold it together beautifully. Mid-face check. Keanu now low center of gravity. Keeps it moving. You see both Aces and Keanu's waves on the end section here. Going a little flat, but this one stood up for Keanu and he's going to really capitalize with a final sweep. Berth on the qualifying series ladder. Yeah, he's not exactly got his job done on a QS. And here you go, there's that rhythm. You can see this is a small wave, but it's hugging that sand. And right there, that's easily the best turn. That turn right there. We'll see if we can slow mo it. I love the way he got upside down. Uh, and you can't get upside down and smack that lip on your backhand unless you got a lot of flow and speed going into that maneuver. Nice finish right there, too. Look at that spray. Swift little snap right there in the pocket. So Keanu is saying, not the biggest guy on tour, but definitely he's got some strong legs underneath him. So, you know, he can deliver some power. Ace Bucken, we always talk, talk about his precision. He doesn't really have much wasted movement in the water. He does do a little wiggle before he turns. You see that little weave before he goes into his snaps? It's just to feel that rail, to get that rail engaged. But that's going to be a non-issue right there in terms of a score. So for Keanu Singh, you know, it's pretty cool. It's fun this, to talk about these personalities, too. Very different. And he took out Kelly in, in uh, his win in Tahiti as well. So that's a feather in the cap. Now Ace will attack the lip. That is a trademark Ace approach. You see how he gets over the center of his board. Beautiful wrap there as well. So three nice turns out on the face. Just collecting himself with what we call the cutback. Another one as he just digs it. Now both surfers in motion, love the wide shot here, ace on the inside, through to the pocket section, Keanu's out, so the judges will have swung their focus backwards and forwards between the two athletes, soaking it all in, of course the judges have the ability, independent of us, the viewers, to pull up replays at will, they can reference scores, so they don't miss any detail of any wave, even if both surfers are in motion at the same time, Ross. Yeah, you're not going to miss anything. we got cameras everywhere. And a nice opening snap for Keanu. Again, uh, I can't help but just, just notice this surfboard looks on fire for him. He is going wherever he wants to on the wave, not dictated at all by his equipment. Nice opening floater. A little rock and roll there. So adding some flavor to, you know, what is pretty much of a pedestrian maneuver. You know, it's functional. A lot of times you get trapped behind a long section. No worries, you just float the boat, get right back out to the flats. Uh, but so far, both Adrian Buchan and Keanu Singh, they haven't found that wave that's offered a series of maneuvers. It's kind of like one big section, then the wave goes flat. So whoever gets that first magical wave is really going to open, open up this heat. Numbers dropping in, and there is a 683 on the screen for Keanu. So finding some rhythm, you mentioned uh, how in sync he's looking with his equipment there, Ross. See steady pulses here in the North Atlantic. Both surfers showing interest, and priority belongs to Keanu Singh, so he'll play that. And here he gets going. Swift backhand lines from Keanu. Mid-face check, top turn again. Nice release, he's getting that angle very vertical and that's a critical line drawn on a dumping lip. So Keanu is seeing in good motion here and well also keeping Ace Bucken off that wave there Ross. Yeah that was great surfing there from Keanu Singh. He's in he's in good rhythm right now. Uh, you know he's caught in the best waves in this heat. 6.8 I even thought would have gone a little higher so I would think that would fire him up uh, saying alright judges take this so beautiful floating maneuver that's not as easy as that uh, looked right there. That's always sketchy when you do those foam climbs. Great second snap for Piano. Again, a compact surfer, and that allows him to really hang tight in, the, in that transition and explode out of it. Uh, you know, he really coils up. I love to see it though. He's not done. He's got Hawaii. Ace trying to give him some action right back. Nice sweep right there into the corner. This is a great heat right here. Ace doesn't like it. He's out. Keanu, his last wave. Looked like the best wave of the heat to me, boys. Thanks, Strider. Just uh, a, another question quickly. Looking at uh, sparky numbers there for Keanu, is seeing a 7-6-7 seven, seven now in his scoreline. Are you seeing some of the best surfing from Keanu thus far on tour? Uh, any other highlights for you as we think about his uh, where he finds himself, Strider? <laughs> Um, so, I, you know, I saw a couple in the rip and they'd kind of appear and then disappear and, and I just thought I'd, I'd keep it 
on my mind and it wasn't like, you know, I wasn't too fast. I knew I could still get some decent scores in my back end, but um, I thought, hey, if one shows up, if Chris has got some good scores, if Coco's got good scores, then I can try and get it right and see what happens. And uh, Ace will play his priority and he'll pick out this medium-sized runner, vertical attack, little flare of the tail there. Now second. Oh, and it's vertical and it's just a touch too tight and he gets compressed. So wow, play of the priority. It now passes to Keanu. Opportunity spilt for Ace Bucken right there. Losing out in round three. So uh, Keanu Singh's gonna be psyched to hand him that one. Well, both surfers finishing 13th here last year. Keanu Singh will go one better now as he'll move to round four of competition. And you see how much that means to him there. Just a love and gratitude for the opportunity to keep moving through the draw here at the Quicksilver Pro. It's an official result.